Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. My name is Cameron Prochaska and I'm an elementary education major and today I will be reading another book out loud for you guys. Please check out my other videos that I've uploaded. Today we will be reading Llama Llama Red Pajama by Anna Dudney. I hope I pronounced that right. I'm sorry if I did not. Llama Llama Red Pajama reads a story with his mama. Mama kisses baby's hair. Mama Llama goes downstairs. Llama Llama Red Pajama feels alone without his mama. Baby Llama wants a drink. Mama's at the kitchen sink. Llama Llama Red Pajama calls down to his Llama Mama. <laughs> this is a tongue twister, I'm not gonna lie. Mama says she'll be up soon. Baby Llama hums a tune. Llama Llama Red Pajama waiting, waiting for his mama. Mama isn't coming yet. Baby Llama starts to fret. What do you guys think fret means? Hmm. Llama Llama Red Pajama whimpers softly for his mama. Mama Llama hears the phone. Baby Llama starts to moan. Llama Llama Red Pajama listens quiet for his mama. What is Mama Llama doing? Baby Llama starts boo-hooing. Do you guys know how to boo-hoo? I don't hear you. Llama Llama Red Pajama hollers loudly for his mama. Baby Llama stomps and pouts. Baby Llama jumps and shouts. Llama Llama Red Pajama in the dark without his mama. Eyes wide open, covers drawn. What if Mama Llama's gone? Llama Llama Red Pajama, weeping, wailing for his mama. Will his mama ever come? Mama Llama, run, run, run! She's running frantically. Baby Llama, what a tizzy. Sometimes mama's very busy. Please stop all this llama drama and be patient for your mama. Little Llama, don't you know? Mama Llama loves you so. Mama Llama is always here, even if she's not right here. Llama Llama Red Pajama gets two kisses from his mama. Snuggles pillows soft and deep. Baby Llama goes to sleep. Thank you guys so much for listening. I am going to make another Google form. I don't know if any of you guys were interested in that yesterday, but I really had a fun time creating it. As I was reading this, have you guys ever felt if your parent or your family member was gone, you just felt so anxious and so nervous and you had no idea what was going on? I remember when I was little, I literally had to be put to sleep with one of my parents rubbing my back or my grandma if I was at my grandma's house because I was just so scared to fall asleep alone. And that's okay, you grow out of it, it's fine. So yeah, if you guys have anything that you want to talk to me about, please DM me on my Instagram page at Cambry13. And please, please, please do this Google form. Um, if you're a parent out there, this is a great way to assess their reading comprehension or their writing skills. So please do that. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you liked it, please give it a thumbs up down below and subscribe to my channel. I will be back tomorrow with another book for you guys to read. Bye.